In this video, we're going to convert from rectangular coordinates to polar coordinates. So let's find the polar coordinates of a point with Cartesian coordinates x, y, negative root 2, comma, negative root 2. So we want to go from x, y to r, theta. To do this, we're going to need to draw a triangle. So I'm going to draw a triangle here. It's in the third quadrant. And I have negative root 2 for x and negative root 2 for y. And I'm looking for theta and r, so I'm going to have to use some trigonometry to find that. To find r, that's pretty easy. We can use the Pythagorean theorem. So I get negative root 2 squared plus negative root 2 squared. So I get r is equal to the square root. I want to take the square root of each side. If I square this piece, I get 2 plus 2, so I end up with r is 2 when I take the root of 4 there. So I've got 2 comma some angle here. Now to find this angle theta, I'm going to go ahead and use, I know this is 2 now, so I can either use, um, well I could use tangent here, and I can say that tangent Yeah, let's use tangent here. So tangent theta is equal to negative root 2 over negative root 2, which means tangent theta is equal to 1. And I know this occurs at two different spots. It occurs at pi over 4, so theta at pi over 4, and at 3 pi over 4. Oh, not 3 pi over 4, uh, 5 pi over 4. Now, 5 pi over 4 is in the third quadrant. I need this thing to be in the third quadrant. So I'm going to have to use the 5 pi over 4 part for theta because my triangle is in the third quadrant. So I have 2 comma 5 pi over 4 for our polar coordinate. 